Hello, my name is David of Aeron's Coffee. Today, we are going to review the Flare manual espresso machine. We have two espresso machines, Pro 2 espresso maker and Neo espresso maker. So the biggest difference between the Pro 2 and the Neo is the pressure gauge. So Neo 2 has a pressure gauge and another difference between two machines is the shape of the bottom uh, of the portal filter. So Pro 2, you can choose either naked portal filter version or you can put the funnel to make it one streamline. And Neo has the plastic piece to make it one streamline and there's no way you can do the bottomless type of the portal filter design. So I'm going to go through the Pro 2 first and then explain in more detail about the Neo. The Flare Pro 2 espresso maker comes with 46 millimeter tamper and the cover for the brewing chamber and the optional plastic tamper and funnel for the dosing espresso to the brewing chamber. And the biggest feature of Pro 2 make espresso maker is this pressure gauge so you can see how much pressure you're building up in the brewing chamber while you're pulling espresso shot. And this brewing chamber is consists of this pressure gauge, bottom espresso shot funnel, water filter with the shower screen and the filter basket, and the water chamber. So when you make espresso, simply you grind coffee and put the ground coffee in the pour filter basket. So I recommend to use 14 grams, but you can uh, use up to 16 grams of ground coffee in this portal filter. And the portal filter size is 46 millimeter, maybe plus minus 0.5 millimeter is still fit into the filter basket. And shower screen on top of the espresso coffee bed, and then the brewing chamber, the water chamber, go on top of the portal filter, filter basket. And what I like about this Flare espresso machine, Flare Pro 2 espresso maker is uh, this rubber parts cover all the metal parts. So all the parts when you assemble it or disassemble it after you make a coffee, uh, it prevents you from the heat. So that is a really good um, safety function. And then you pour water to the water chamber. So you can use between 90 degrees Celsius to 96 degrees Celsius coffee, depends on what coffee you're using. But the water chamber capacity is 70 milliliter, similar to 70 grams of water. So if you are using 14 grams of coffee, then I recommend to use 65 grams of water. And if you're using 60 grams of coffee, then I recommend to use 70 grams of water to brew coffee. And then after you pour water in here, you put the pressure gauge on top. So pressure gauge is also attached to the stem that flare lever is pressing down. So secure it well. And then this funnel, espresso funnel, is comes with the Pro 2 espresso maker. But if you want to see how your shot is pulling down from the portal filter, you can use it as it is, as naked bottom. If your cup is like small and you're worrying about the like, espresso comes out of your cup, doesn't fall into your cup, then you can use this funnel. But yeah, it is a good option. But I prefer to not using this one. After you put everything ready, then your lever pushing down your espresso. And another good detail about this Pro 2 espresso machine, it, it comes with the two layers of tray. So the bottom tray is blank tray and it has some space to capture water and the top tray is with holes so you can keep water a little bit of last few drops of espresso in onto the tray and your top tray it has a hole so you can dump out a small amount of water to the bottom so it is a good detail if it is like flat then you always need to wipe it down but you have some like space to put some dirty water and we also uh, going to bring lots of uh, accessories like a mirror attached to the bottom so you can see how your shots are pulling down and we also are going to bring extra tempers and replacement parts so if you need some upgrade you can uh, 
purchase those small accessories to your Pro 2 Espresso Maker. The next model is Flare Neo Espresso Maker. So this one is $160 and it comes with the dozing funnel and plastic tamper and brewing chamber, lever and a tray. So this one is very similar to the Pro 2 but it's more simpler version of manual coffee maker. So when you brew coffee, you can pour 60 grams of water or 60 milliliters of water maximum. So it is slightly smaller capacity compared to Pro 2. And for coffee uses, I recommend to use uh, 13 to 14 grams of coffee. And if you like to drink stronger coffee, then you can go up to like 16 grams of coffee, but it will be uh, much stronger than recommended coffee dose. So it comes with the brewing water chamber, the funnel, and the stem for the pressure. Comes with the shower screen on top and the portafilter filter, filter basket. And you can close and open the bottom lid. And when you pour, pull the espresso, make sure your bottom piece is opened. And yeah, simply uh, you put the coffee and then Tamp it with plastic tamper. Then put the shower screen on top of the filter basket and attach to the water chamber. Pour hot water 90 to 296 degrees Celsius and put the stem or the pressure with your cup down here. Then push it down. So, because it doesn't have the pressure gauge, I recommend to use just full strength you, you can use. In that way, you can keep your own consistency between shot to shot. And that's the one way you can maintain your pressure same. Or you can play with different like lower pressure and higher pressure with this machine. So uh, it comes with a single tray, but the tray at the bottom has a little texture. So it still captures some water inside. It's not flooding outside of the machine. And it also covered with the silicone pieces. So it still prevents your hands from hot metal pieces so it helps to easy to clean and assemble and disassemble the pieces. In the near future on top of these two models we are going to bring in Flare 58 espresso maker and 58X espresso makers. Those are higher end manual espresso maker. The biggest feature of those two models is they are using 58 millimeter filter basket which is standard commercial espresso machine filter basket and 58 has the preheat power unit comes with it so you can preheat your espresso machine without hot water so the electric power is heating up before you pull the espresso shot so it maintains your water temperature high from the beginning so those two are coming soon in our shop, so stay tuned for those two models. And also we are bringing more and more accessories for all Flare Espresso Maker machines. So that will help you to upgrade your Espresso Maker as well. So that is it for the Flare Espresso Maker. We are uploading our video on our YouTube channel every week. So if you have any specific question about Flare machine or if you want us to review certain products, then please leave a comment there. And until next time, happy brewing.